This is the Miller's Daughter, which is a 57-foot cruiser stern narrowboat launched in 2011, built by Orchard Marine. Uh, it's an extremely well looked after boat. The owners have taken great care of it and it has a good number of extras. You can see here you have a well deck. There's a cratch cover with clear flexi panels in it as well. And then you come down into the saloon. Plenty of cupboards, flat screen television there in the corner. As you spin around, there's the first of several radiators that are run by a Wabasto diesel central heating boiler. In the opposite corner, you have a Morso Squirrel multi fuel stove on its own tiled hearth. And then you have a saloon with space for freestanding furniture. The upholstered swivel chairs that you see at the moment are not included in the sale. Um, at the back end of the saloon, pretty spacious, you have an L-shaped dinette. This can break down into a temporary double berth for occasional guests as well. And then beyond that, the galley area, wine rack, more cupboard space of course, and uh, granite worktops, microwave, 12 volt fridge and gas cooking by way of a four burner hob and an oven and grill set below it. Floor is engineered and the panels of the cabin sides, hull sides and indeed the ceiling are all from light American oak. Then you have a short corridor uh, down which you have the bathroom off to the right. In here you have a, a countertop basin on a stone surface with a vanity unit below. Next to that a pump out macerator WC chrome towel rail as you can see. Small amount of storage to the side for towels and so forth, next to a corner quadrant shower which has sliding clear screen doors and a thermostatic mixer tap shower unit. Next up is the bedroom. In here you have a permanent double berth, wardrobe space, chest of drawers built into it, and second flat screen television there. and overhead cupboards as well. One of these cupboards houses an 1800 watt inverter by the way to run the main system when you're not on shoreline. And then finally you have the cruiser stern deck and beneath that deck board the Izutsu engine that powers the boat along. For a full brochure, a layout plan and a photo gallery please go to rugbyboats.co.uk